Road for Good Southwest Limited was founded four years ago. It's a registered charity. The project is a gardening project, but really it's more about growing people than growing vegetables and plants. Um, we use horticulture as the tool to bring those people together. Um, and hopefully at the end of the day or at the end of the week, um, people go home feeling an awful lot better about themselves. We have volunteers who have just retired and want to give something and keep busy. Others have actually been referred by GPs. Uh, unfortunately, a lot of people that suffer from depression um, can wait up to a year for a counselling service and all that the GPs can do is to send these people home with antidepressants. They can actually say to them, you need to get out, mix with some, a new group of people, keep physically active. They come to us and know that this is a safe environment. I really enjoy it. it I've been suffering for the past sort of seven years with anxiety and depression um, and it's got me out of the house and gradually sort of getting me out of my shell. Uh, I get to meet sort of lots of different people, get to be out in the fresh air and just have fun really. A good way of keeping fit and keeping your social skills up because if, or else you would just sit at home. It's been a great uh, way of meeting new friends and uh, um, reasons why I came it, but it's worked for me because it's given me the chance to uh, to start a new life almost. I fell to my husband um, three years ago so it's been a way of um, coming and uh, you know meeting new people trying to sort of fill the gap that uh, I had but it's certainly done that it's it's amazing. During the term times we also work with youngsters that have been excluded from mainstream education we're also in the process of setting up um, an accredited uh, training system to work with uh, kids from social services, uh, kids in care. We mix those in with the volunteers because it's part of um, their education in communication skills. Um, trying to develop a better attitude and a mix with adult community. And the mix of conversation that you get with the young people when they first start, it's monosyllabic. And then after a few weeks, you can actually see them answering questions about themselves and calling people by their first name. And that's just, it's huge. It's huge. The project is many fold. It grows salad crops in the polytunnels, which we sell into the zoo restaurant, part of the synergy between the project and the zoo itself. The volunteers get to sow seed, they get to maintain and look after the crops and then they actually get to see the stuff bagged up, labelled and they know that what they've done has brought some money into the project and also gives fresh salad stock into the zoo restaurant. Being part of the zoo has just made it even better because it's the we get the, the diverse sort of landscaping things that we have to do, we enjoy, so we work in here growing seeds and um, picking fruit and veg and we go out there and help keep the zoo looking half oh, decent don't we? We're working our way around the zoo grounds um, enhancing the landscape tackling areas that have got overgrown over the years mainly by virtue of the fact that the zoo has taken precedent over the landscape the backbone of the, the project. Just to walk, walk around and actually see a plot of ground that was a big weed patch when we first came and now it's a flower bed. It's nice to see that we, we can actually make an impact. Bit by bit we're converting the grounds. It gives all of our volunteers the chance to feel involved in actually working in the zoo. With the Grow for Good being based on the zoo grounds and getting involved with working in the zoo, I get to see all the animals and um, learn the odd thing listening to the keepers when they do their talks um, and it's just yeah, nice being involved in a big sort of family feeling sort of project. We feel a sense of pride of having helped do the zoo, help the zoo look better and we enjoy just what we do so the whole project is, um, is very worthwhile.